Hello, my good friend, and how are you doing? Welcome back to another episode of Supermarket. Supermarket recently had a huge restocking or storage upgrade, and we've taken advantage of that. As you can see, we went ahead and purchased a lot more racks. I uh, have some stuff still underneath uh, just because of space, limited space, and I'm trying to keep everything as organized as the store is as far as the order in which we have items which go by the actual market itself so both our displays in the store go in this order as well as the storage room and that just kind of makes it easier for me to find stuff but this is this update is like i said in the previous video it is honestly game changing a couple of things that i also miss from the update uh, I'll go over it in a second, but we're able to tell the quantities, which is really cool. Obviously, now it gives you the, the, the picture of the item that you have in here, where before this was just a rack. Uh, so the idea was great, but we didn't know what was in the top, the, the second and the third shelf. If you go from down to, to the top, start at the bottom to the top. But anyways, I still have a couple of boxes here because these are items that run out quick, and I do plan to do some more cash registering today so on that note let's go in order of that let's see here so we're making some progress we're at 597 out of 900 so little by little i'm not planning to get there tomorrow or the day after it's just one of those things that we will gradually get to uh the other stuff that i completely missed is we have restocker um we have the ability to hire a restocker and so what is required is uh we're required to have a storage which we do we were supposed to have at least one uh, rack, and we have nine. And then we're, store level is supposed to be at 15, so we're at, I think, uh, 26. So we can technically hire two. We're going to start with one, but I'm not going to hire him yet because I already did all the purchasing and stocking up. So we're going to hold off for a little bit. Uh, we'll go today uh, just with my work, and then tomorrow, obviously, when I start buying more inventory, we'll hire him and see how he works because I don't know how he works. I haven't been keeping up with the other series series that are on YouTube, so I do not know how he works. Uh, the next thing we need to do is pay bills. That's always a must. Uh, and then I want to see what it would cost to upgrade our actual store itself. And we talked about this area back here. So it's 4400 but we spoke about this gap back here that kind of opened up with that, with, with our last update. So I'm going to shoot to get to 4400 without obviously shooting ourselves in the foot and not having money to purchase more uh, inventory. Because my goal is before I put this against that wall and that wall is to open this up as well. So we'll have kind of like a little, kind of like an L shape, if you may, um, until we can bust all three walls. So the next wall is this one. And that way we can kind of expand backwards and start putting up some more shelves and open up our inventory as well. So having said that, we have Junior here ready to go. I'm ready to go. The store is restocked. Let's go ahead and get started. Go ahead and open the store. Make sure it stays open. I don't know why every time I click on that once, for some reason, I end up double clicking. So maybe it's my quick finger, right? Uh, everything else is the same. Nothing, nothing. I haven't changed anything up front. I am aware that I can change this computer. There was a suggestion to move it back here. I kind of like that because I can kind of see like what I need to order and then just kind of order right away. But <laughs> I'm used to coming in here to check stuff like, you know, how many more rings do I need? Um, it would just take me a little bit to get used to it, but it's honestly a really good idea. Also, it, it allows, it, it opens up the store uh, as far as space goes. So I might do it. I'm still thinking about it. Uh, thank you for that suggestion, by the way. Thank you all for the comments, the support. It's been great. Um, I know there are a couple days between episodes, and I'm just glad to be back. So let's go ahead and get started. Let's ring up some people, have some fun, hopefully laugh a little bit, have a little bit of joy. And as you can see, our sugar's already down. People just pick up stuff so quickly um, that I, I need to keep up with it. So let's go ahead and continue ringing up here. Let me see. You need change, sir. $84. Of course you do. 84 and 60 cents. Off you go. Thank you for coming and have yourself a good one. Wish we could close this door. Because right here it looks like a 99 cent store, right? With the door open. If we could close that store and said like employees only, that would make it like super official. 
All right, all right, sir. What are you purchasing? All right, just some detergent, some plastic for 80. There you go. Thank you. Hello, ma'am. Cereal, orange juice, some G's, some G's, some cheese and eggs. <laughs> uh, 47.70. Off you go. Hello, sir. More plastic, 560. Yes, please. Hello, ma'am. Oh my gosh, I'm seeing her like little doctor get up there. I've been binging um, this series. Um... Called the the resident if you guys have seen it, it's um I used to watch it on TV, but they recently added it to Netflix and I think I was behind a whole season. So I went and started watching it and all I've seen is scrubs and doctors and right now seeing that lady with like the the doctor get up her little vest jacket. I'm like, oh my gosh, I can't get away from it. It's just a little funny. Hello ma'am. Oh wow. A little shopping today. I like it. You need change and it's $40.40. We can definitely handle that. Thank you. Have yourself a good day. How's everything else going? Everything looking smooth. Silky smooth like the Zohan would say. I make you silky smooth. All right. Very good. Life is good. You're good. Junior, you're good. Need anything? Water? You look like you're trapped, buddy. I'm sorry. <laughs> Hope you're not claustrophobic. Because you look like you're trapped. Uh, we need some milk. Uh, where is our milk? Uh, milk. Yeah, see, milk right here. I have milk. Oh, I don't have milk. I thought I had milk. Wait. Oh, yeah. I have some over here. And then I have to place some over here for... um, Because I ran out of room. So I think eventually I'll be able to organize in a way where I know, like what stuff is required for me to have maybe a full rack for her. like definitely the detergent getting a rack for that probably a smart thing because it takes so much space on its own but even then i think putting it up i think it's only one per but it'd probably be a smart thing so ideally in this game you want to get fully upgraded so you have all the space in the world and I can't wait to see how the how the stalker dude works. 190. Keep saying stalker, huh? The restocker. The inventory guy. My merchandiser. There we go. Can we call him merchandiser? That's a thing, right? The merch boy. Merch person. Merch individual. $93, sir. What are you doing to me with that change? Go take your hundred dollar bill somewhere else. I need to buy a sign that says no no bills over twenty dollars accepted. That's a thing, isn't it? Oh shoot. What did you guys buy? What did you guys buy? Oh what goes here? See? This is why I like having here this right here. What the heck? What what did we run out of already? Uh chocolates? No. It's after after this. The cleaner what is it i can't figure out what it is it's before the windex before the windex oh the bleach i was just talking about the bleach see look at the bleach here's the bleach right here all right i need to put them up because otherwise they're gonna be like we you run out of a product we don't like you we don't like your store we're gonna go across the street to rite aid Oh my gosh, is it me or is like Rite Aid, Rite Aid groceries the most expensive in the world? Like, I'll go in there for band-aids and be like, oh, they have milk. And then I'll be like, oh, you know what? I'll just drive to the whatever market. It's like, they take advantage of the fact that you're there late. So they probably assume like, hey, he's they're not going to want to drive somewhere else to pick up stuff. Spaghetti's running low. Let me see. What do I have here that's in my way? The sugar. Jumped over those people. Let's go. Hit the matrix, dude. That's fine. Oh, we have milk. Oh, okay. That's from the last time I kind of filled that up. Uh, I know I'm running out of pasta. I always run out of pasta. That's a thing. So, yeah, in the morning, um, obviously, we'll stay here in the, with the episode. In the morning, we'll we'll hire... Oh, my gosh. I'm out of the... I know that's the the old school flower. I'm coming. This one right here. Yeah, we'll hire the the merch dude, and then he can 
We can see him in action and see exactly what he does. I think I read in one of my comments that they, um, that they sometimes throw away stuff. Like an item here and there. Honestly, I don't mind if it's like one or two. Sometimes I feel like throwing stuff away just so that I don't have to run back. Um, but, I mean, it's the price you pay. And I'm purposely going to leave some of this stuff. These guys are almost done. I want to see how he restocks. Uh, I hope I don't run out of anything, but I want to hire him. You know what? I'm running out of sugar. I mean, I don't need to see him restock everything, right? Where's my sugar? Uh, watermelon sugar, where are you? Oh, it's up here. Yeah, I kind of, I, I'm intrigued to see how he restocks. The if, is he slow like Junior? Then I got to do it, obviously, off. Um, before, before I open up the store or after I close. So I'm interested to see how those logistics work. Uh, 90 cents. There you go. Off you go, ma'am. We made pretty good money. We're at 41.20. Granted, I don't have to buy much. I don't think I might be able to do that upgrade in this episode, which would be really cool. And then the other thing is, this is kind of a noob question, but I, technically if I hit enter now, it'll kick everyone out. But if I close this, nobody else will come in, right? Because I, what I've noticed in this game is that people still come in even after you, after it's nine o'clock. And I'm not talking about the people that are already inside the store. I'm talking about people just walk in. All right, cool. Uh, let's see. All right, very good. As soon as we ring up these people, we'll we'll hit that enter button to go to the next day and see how much we made. It probably won't be a lot because I restock a lot of our stuff. Like, I honestly, well, other than sugar, which I should probably queue up since we're in the subject, on the subject, not in. I'll get three of you. Let me add it. I don't think I have any on the floor. That's the other thing is sometimes, yeah, I don't have any on the floor. Okay. Uh, anything else? Just that. See, it's cool because you can see these numbers. So there's only 16 there, but I have more over here. Because I, I just overloaded on this because this always runs out. Same with my blue one. I'm going to get two more of those as well. Uh, one, two, three. I'll just get three. And then, yeah, see, this is why it would be cool to have it back here, but I'm just used to having it up front. And we have two computers. That would be lit. All right, cool. So we're te we technically have enough to upgrade. Then we'd be left with zero money. See, that's already out. That's crazy. If I upgraded the space one more time in the store, it would leave us with no money. Well, it would leave us with 400, no, for 55 bucks. I think it's 4,400. Yeah, it is 44. It would leave us with 55 bucks. Granted, I don't have to um, buy any inventory for this next day, but the day after I would have to. So it's kind of a close call. Let's go ahead and finish the day. 45 days. Wow. So I spent 1,700 in supplies. Uh, we spent $1,200 on the, the racks. And so we lost $937. So let's go ahead and start the next day. We got cereal, spaghetti, and peanut butter changing in price. So you went up to $570. Spaghetti went up to, ooh, nice, $720. It's a good change. And cereal. Oh, which one was it though? Well, we'll try them both, see which one it is. Uh, it's not this one. And the other one is right here. Nobody took a lot. This one usually often runs out as well. Usually often. You like that? This one often runs out fairly fast and it didn't this time. So that's really good. All right. Let's see what's up. Let's see what's up with this with this new employee dude. Let me go ahead and I should I should probably order something else. I know, right? Um, What else should I order? Detergent. Like I said, I'm pretty like happy with the amount of of stuff that i have for pretty much everything and the unfortunate thing is that i do have some stuff down here like right here it shows that i only have 12 of these but i have two more boxes over here same with the windex the windex is uh up here and it shows that i have 24 but then i have three over here so all right we'll just order that i don't think i'm too worried about the four dollar shipping fee all right let's do that let's go ahead and pay bills management uh bills go ahead and pay you off let's get rid of that first right Let's go ahead and hire this young cat. Hired. All right, what does he do? 
There's my inventory. Where's my dude? Oh, hey, what's up? My good dude. Okay, he's super slow. <laughs> Doing his thing, though. Yeah, but he's super, super slow. I need to help. With my in, like lack of patience, I'm just going to... I mean, he's going to help me. I'm going to keep him. That, it's really cool. I, I, oh, shoot. Wait, what am I doing? I grabbed the wrong box for starters, but that's fine. I'm going to keep him, but I think hiring the second one would, for me, for my high expectation energy vibes, I wouldn't, I need to hire another one. I meant to grab this. Yeah. Is he restocking? Yeah, he's, he's restocking. I mean, he's, he works, right? It's, it's good. Life is good here. Not going to complain. I'm going to say he's uh, related to Junior, though, <laughs> based on his speed. Um, you know what? Let me grab that again. Yeah, let me put you down here. So it's only one. That way I know that I, the bottom one has the least amount. Something like this, this number. And see, this is what I mean. So the perfect example. So I'm out of room. I can't add any more. And so I would have to move stuff all the way, shift over to make room for one more. So what I like to do is either put it in the next one. Or if I have time, I can do is just put one back there and then put another one here. But unfortunately, when you place stuff on the ground, it doesn't it doesn't move this number. And so I order sugar as well, right? And we need sugar out of sugar. For sure. OK, and have wait, is this done? Yeah, it's done. And put this over here. I'm sure he also restocks the outside. I'm assuming. I'm hoping. But he is super slow. I want to get some angry customers before I get happy ones. Let me just, uh, you know, I have this here. And throw that in here for now. I mean, he's good. Yeah. No, I, I, I love this. I love this. And I can't believe I missed this. On the on the last video, because this update was out on the last video, and I was just excited about the racks having um, labels and numbers. Got really excited about that. So, are we doing the same stuff? No, we're not. Okay, good. I like that. There's no point in double teaming one item. Okay. Um, you go there. So I only have twelve of those. That's not good. All right, I'm going to order some detergent and then what did I say? I only had 12 of the, oh no, see, I don't have 12 of those. I have more than that. Wait, where's the 12? Oh, this one. Yeah, so I only have 12 of the, the shampoo. That's technically the shampoo. So let's order shampoo and more detergent. I'll bring those in and then I'll bring you back to start the, start the, the next day. All right, very cool. Let's go ahead and turn on the lights. Nice. Let's go ahead and hit enter. I'm going to count on this dude, like, completely restocking the store while I ring up. And we should be good. Uh, let me, let's check our number. Always want to see this progress. We're already in the right. Wait, 597? Isn't that what I had last time? Complete checkouts. Five, I swear I, I had 597 last time. I'm a little bit confused. Wait. Okay, okay, I get it. I get it. This is the number that's moving up. That's really weird. So it got stuck at 597 because I, I opened these up and it won't move up unless I go to the box where I still can't hire somebody. That's really interesting. But that makes sense that I went from 597 to 617, about 20 customers on my own. Oh, shoot. I got to open the store. But. OK, OK. Believe it or not, like I'm in um, day 45, day 20, no, yeah, day 45, level 26. I'm still learning. There are a lot of like little things about this game that you can really overlook, uh, especially when you are trying to do kind of a a play by play, per se, on the videos, as well as focus on what you have to order and stuff like that. So that's cool. I like that. It keeps me on my toes for sure. 
because I feel it in my fingers and I feel it in my toes. All right, 3,800. See, we need to make a good amount here so that I can, so that I'm confident enough to do the upgrade and know that I'm not going to run out of stuff. You feel me there? I hope you feel me there. All right, let's go. Let's get it cranking. I got to be super, super happy register boy here. Whatever that means. All right, here we go. Finally, a customer. I've been standing around waiting for one. For me to ring up. Junior over there has all the action. Just not cool. I want to play too, you know what I mean? Put me in, coach. Put me in. I'm ready. I am ready. Of course, I'm going to want to help him. Like, look at this. Like, he needs help, right? Should I just let him, let him, let him be? Do his thing? Should I be that controlling manager or owner? What was that term for it? Um, there was a term where your like boss was like on top of you all the time. Micromanager. That one. You guys remember that word? Th that term? Is your boss a micromanager? That's what everybody would want to know. Is your boss a micromanager? Some people can micromanage like good. You know what I mean? And what I mean by good, like annoyingly good. Like, they'll tell you how to do one thing ten times, and you're just like, bro, I got it. Like, the first time you told me. They just, like, trust in you. And if they do it to everyone, they just trust, they don't trust them, their ability to teach you correctly. Insufficient change, my dude. Means I owe you money. Yes, I owe you money. Alright, cool. Off you go. How are we doing? I think we'll pull the trigger, guys. We'll do it. We'll do the update right now. As soon as I get 4,400. Because we still have the rest of the day to close out to get whatever money we need to. To buy anything that we're missing. You need some change. $97. A really? Oh, shoot. I did this backwards. 80 cents. Off you go. All right, cool. Do we have it? We have it. Let's do it. I'm doing it. Update. Management. Uh, growth. Bam. 4,400. Let's go. All right. So now we have... Ooh, that looked cool. So we have that now. So I'm going to wrap this stuff around. And we're still going to keep this, this display format where we're just putting stuff against the walls. And then eventually we'll do the whole, like, you know, 7-Eleven look where you have the, the shelves in the middle. And you kind of have like aisles you walk through and we'll see how we can uh, organize that a lot better but that's that's going to be the cool part for me is organizing it and making it in a way look in a way where it's organized and you know and i know exactly what i need to order and stuff like that so just thinking about it i think mastering the storage room to the point where whatever is missing in the storage room is what i need to order would probably the, be the best call. That means I probably will have to move my, my computer to the back. Because regardless of what's going on in front of the store, as long as this is managed correctly with this dude, like we're set. I don't have to worry about anything other than making sure that that is all stocked up. Look at him carry that. Bro, watch your lower back. You need to get one of them little lift weight, lift weight uh, belts. Them big support thingies that the strong dudes wear. So you don't throw out your back carrying that big box. Uh, I'll help you out. We need some of this. We're running out. Especially if it clears out the box completely. So we're at 460. I don't even know what I can order with 460 nowadays, to be honest with you. The last time I checked... The amount <laughs> when I placed an order was like maybe day four. <laughs> I was worried about not having enough. But now it's like I just order. Like I need this. Okay, give me five. And I just order it. I don't even look at the amount. It's crazy. But we're doing good. We got that upgrade. We're at almost 600. I need to order lights. Let's order lights. Because you know me. I like my lights. Uh, wrong button. More kit. Uh, let me do. Let's start with four. For 160. And I'll, I'll put those up in the morning. We don't have to do it now. Hello, man. 
plastic, of course. 6270 is your change. I'm sorry, is the total, not your change. You got caught up on cash mode. You want change, of course. 390, 1, 2, 3, 50, 75, 85, 90. Off you go. Thank you, come again. All right, can I... S Ooh, I can't slip down. Look at this. Nice. This could be my office. Heck, screw the store. I want my office. Okay, I like that. He looks... He. It looks like he's, like, restocking stuff that's kind of running out. Like, prioritizing, which I like. His AI is pretty... It's pretty... It's pretty good. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. Uh, I see I can help you with this, and now we don't have boxes down here. Perfect. I like it when an unplanned plan comes together. All right, we need to work on the candy over there, brother. I'm not trying to micromanage you here, but thinning up a little bit. All right, one nine sixty two. Again, I don't know what I can order with that. It remains to be seen. I do need to order more shelves, though, if I want to open up. Um, what are the next items? If I don't get wrong up here, uh, it's not growth. It's licenses. 750. That's the other thing is we gotta we gotta purchase it before I get all this stuff. I'm assuming some of those are cold items. I think my cold situation is good. I have like a lot of stuff is four four stack, which doesn't have to be. I'll walk over there and show you guys in a minute. Like for example, I can cut this down to three. This is also four. I can cut it down to three. I can cut everything to three. And I have a lot of room to add new items, so I don't need to purchase more uh, refrigerators at the moment. And we can have a smooth upgrade. I think that's a good goal. And we'll end up with roughly around 1500 after the update, so that's good. I don't want to move anything in case somebody walks in. I don't know if that messes up there. Their ability to see what's available and what's not. Kind of cheat a little bit so we can fit one in here. Let me see if it'll let me. Yep, it will. That's the one thing that's a little... Oh, this is a fridge. Okay. Alright, I totally lost track of that. I thought it was going to be another one of those racks. That's fine. Fridge is fine. We can put those here for now. I'm already feeling this. This is looking good. The good thing about these employees is they like work 24-7. They're not like me where I, I'm, I work 8 hours and I start complaining. Um, Yeah, 24-7 is good. Let me kind of look back here. Look at these quantities. Okay, that's a zero. But however, we have some over here. Whoa, what was that? That was weird. Y'all see that? Okay, I know I need to order more of those. Those run out so fast. Uh, maybe cereal and perhaps bread. So technically the first three items and then my lights. So we go here. Not license. Well, should I just buy it? Sure, what the heck. Oh, but that means now I have to purchase. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. I shouldn't have done that. I pulled the trigger. Let's go. Okay, uh, products. Let's go. Let's go. I got to get them. Okay, so we have... What do I do? Two of each? Order. I think if I just click this twice, it's faster. One, two. One, two. One, two. One. Oh, I can't. Wait, I'm already. Oh, because of the lights. All right, let's go ahead and tender. Well, I can't tender that out. Was I able to. I'm assuming. How many lights did I order? All right, let me do. Let me just do two for now. So I can order at least this, right? Okay, two of each. And then I'll have these left over. We have 502. <laughs> wow. Uh, <we'll> go ahead. <laughs> I can't purchase that till the next morning. But we carry on. Let's go. Uh, how are we doing? How are we doing? Let's. So when I tender out. Oh, no. You know what? I can move some of these lights over. Yeah, let's do that. I think I'm a little, little light happy here. Let's go ahead and remove this one. Hopefully, it doesn't make too much of a, ch of a change here. Yeah, there we go. There we go. That's good. That works, right? You guys agree? Okay. Good call, good call. I'm glad we looked up. Uh, let's go back to market and let's take the lights out. Lights, 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 lights. Can we delete it? Okay. And now I can do the eggs. Two pack. The only thing is I'm only ordering two. Two pack. Two pack. <laughs> so 
It's not the best. I got to figure out a way to organize that. Let's go ahead and hit enter. See how we did. A little bit better. Only 305 in supply costs. Um, oh, but the big upgrade. So, but we did, we did well. Without the upgrade, uh, we would have netted about 1600. Well, a little bit less than that. Maybe like 1500, which is good. Let's go ahead and start the new day. I'm going to go ahead and tender this out really quick. Because I still need to get the, sh the sugar powder. Um, powder sugar, technically, is the way it should be. But it's not. So let me go ahead and add two of you. And then we do one more of each. Just so that we have three. And I wonder if this dude's just going to put it... Oh, I can't even afford that. That's horrible. That's horrible. Okay, that's fine. Let me... We need to pay bills, too. Do I have enough to pay bills? I do. Okay, we have 102 to our name. Is he going to start putting stuff... Where are my Apple stuff? I wonder if he's going to start putting, like, the new stuff just wherever he wants to. That won't be cool. I won't I won't like that at all. Okay, for now, I'm going to do that. Let me go ahead and put these up here. I'm going to get a little organized. I'll bring you guys right back. I need to put this new stuff up. I, I don't even know what it is. So, so these are eggs. Okay, so I guess what I can do is... I can do two of the old school eggs and then two of the new school eggs. I'll get organized and then I'll bring you guys right back. Promise. All right, very good. We're back. Ready for one more day. So this is kind of what we did. And guess what, guys? Guess what? I did not forget to price everything except for the tuna. But all the new stuff is priced. Is this tuna? Yeah, it is tuna. So the tuna is priced. I placed it there as well as what? what the heck is this? Uh, cheese parmesan, okay. So we priced that as well. And then this onion something. I don't know what this is. Oh, mozzarella cheese. It looks like onions. I When I first saw it, I thought it was onions, but uh, mozzarella cheese. Why is everything backwards? Cheese, mozzarella, mozzarella cheese. Huh. All right, so that's 520. And then the super duper dope eggs. These are a four pack of eggs. Uh, they're 220. And so, and then last but not least, the honey. The honey ideally would probably go here. Because that's the last of like a food product and then everything else is a cleaning product. So I'm going to try to separate the cleaning from food, just like any good store would. Um, but because of the box situation, I couldn't do it. And then my dude, whenever I'm like working on adjusting something, he, he just refills it. So it's kind of hard to compete with him unless I fire him and fix it. I don't want to do that. But anyways, let's go ahead and open up, open up the place because we need money. We're at $102. We are about broke. I know there's a way to get a loan, guys, but I don't like doing loans. Like, loans are, to me, here's where I stand on loans, right? Yeah, look, I mean, we would pay, we would get $750, and we would pay $57 a day, which is very doable. It's, it's, it's a joke how how quickly we can pay that off. And I think we can even, like, pay it off with, with one lump, lump um, payment. But I don't like doing that. We, we got to struggle. We got to make it work. Now, if they made you take a loan early to start the business, that's different. I would love that. If somebody said, if they said, hey, we're going to give you a $5,000 loan to open up this store. This is your budget. And you have to pay us back, you know, $60 every day. I wouldn't mind that because you're working towards to finish something. That's really cool. That's one of those like work hard, get rewarded kind of things. I'm all for that. Sign me up. We started, I think, with 50 bucks which wasn't alone, and we started selling, I forgot what it was, one of these guys, and yeah, see, I'm I'm low on this stuff, but I can't order it, I don't have money, let me see, pasta, bread, cereal, let me see if we can do this, uh, and we have to, pay, no, we paid bills already, good, 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 market, uh, pasta, bills, pasta, bills, you like that, uh, pasta, this one, yeah, this one's not expensive, buy three of you, I know I need bread by two of you. It's 390. Wow. Oh, it's because I have stuff queued up. That's what it is. Oh, I haven't bought this. Okay. All right. All right. Uh, we need to get to 398. Stat. Yeah. People are going to get upset because I, I have something, I guess, advertised <laughs> and I'm not selling it. I didn't put it up for display. That sucks. I totally missed out on one, on one item. It's all good. Ma'am, one honey? Really? You see the freaking options I have for you and you purchase one honey. That's all right. I got you. I see how you are. I see how I can't type the right amount in. Hello, my good dude. 
Plastic. Ooh, 27 even. Gotta, gotta love that. All right. Nice. Somebody who's worried about hygiene. I love it. Okay. Uh, where are we at? 370. What is this? How much we need? 390. All right. Come on. Come on. Give me those $20. There you go. All right. Let's go ahead and purchase that. Now, what is it? Wait, I can check right here. It's way down here. It's sugar. So I should be able to. That's the thing. See, I need, I need a box. I need this box so that I can empty at least one of those. How come they're not buying those? Those usually fly off the shelves and they're not today. Uh, that's the problem. That is my only... That's my bottleneck right now is that. That I don't have boxes to put. To put stuff in. Okay, you're full. Place you down here for now. Alright, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Yeah, so, yeah, so I'm not going to be able to display that until something opens up uh you want change ma'am i got your change 890 off you go hello kind sir 340 very good have a good day thanks for coming in see you next time yeah my fridge stuff is good yeah i need can you take two thank you okay where is that thing it's, no it's not that one it's this one pablo sugar now is pablo sugar yeah pablo sugar is an outdoor it's a uh, Outside item. Let's go ahead and toss you if I can. Price you before somebody comes in here. And this is 12 10. I should have left it at 12. It's all good. Um okay, cool. So we we put it up. We're winners. We did it. We did it. Again, see I can't fit anymore, so the only thing I can do is kind of line it up here. But that as you guys know, that pasta just runs out insanely fast. And then I just organized this whole thing and added a new product. So I got to do this again. And that's okay. I don't mind doing that. I can do that uh, without the record button on. And you guys just come back and get to see the the goods. The goods. I'm not going to fix that because I'm going to organize this somehow. Find a way to. And I need these boxes to fix it. So I hope my dude doesn't like condense on his own. And throw the boxes away. I hope he doesn't. If he does, I might have to fire him. While I organize and then rehire him. Now, here's my question. When, when is this cold stuff that I'm storing outside begin to go bad? Where I need to purchase one of the other fridge the thingamajigs. You guys know what I'm talking about? Like this, these eggs right here technically go... Where do they go? They go um, inside the fridge, right? Oh, shoot. I have a line of people. I'm over here being super chill with you guys. Uh, the... So all the stuff that goes in the refrigerator that's not in the refrigerator, I know there's a freezer that I can purchase that I haven't purchased yet. So my stuff's not going bad yet, as far as I know. And then I have the freaking health department walking into my store because I'm selling expired groceries. <laughs> but um, yeah, I need to figure that out. All right, let's go, let's go. I'm feeling this though. I'm I'm loving this update. This update just changed the game for me completely. I was having fun before with it. I'm having even more fun with it now. But I gotta get up to like the big baller status. I feel like I'm, st I'm still a little, little goldfish. You know what I mean? Okay, and they're not taking a lot of the new stuff, which is fine. Yeah, I need them. Oh shoot. Oh no. Okay. So it's, so it's the milk, the regular milk. Okay. So I only have. Well, I have this box here. And see, I want to save this box, and I don't want my dude to throw it away. So I might need this box to organize my store. I'm going to leave it here, see if he throws it away. Hopefully he doesn't. I hope he's not that efficient. I'm going. Someone just took all my coffee. Hello, ma'am. How art thou? 25.90. There you go. Hello, hello. Let's go. More plastic. 52 even. Love to see it. All right, cool. We're 9.14. Thing is, we... Or, you know what? I can technically purchase another shelf and that would just solve all my problems because I could just move things over. How much How much is another shelf? I was in the right screen. Come on. Uh, It's this one, right? Yeah, see these right here? The freezers, 400? It doesn't tell me what it does. It's 200 for one of these. I'm going to add it. I'm going to add it because I'm not too happy that I had to put this down to two. As you can see, it goes... It empties out pretty fast. Uh, I have some right here. I'm going here. I'm going to do this. 
And then I want to leave this again. I need I need boxes tonight. Boxes, boxes. It's like we're moving. Whoa. Hello, sir. Look at you. My goodness. 103.50. I wish I had like 10 of you. That's good though. 1,200. We can technically almost finish the day. All right. So we're not running out of the new stuff, but I should probably should. What? He's stuck here. What's going on here? I think he's been stuck here. I need to move this. Um, why are you stuck there, my dude? I know I should probably not be doing this right now, but I don't know why he's stuck here. Well, move. I. Oh, gosh. <laughs> he's too much. All right. I ran out of coffee. Coffee. Coffee, tea, Sega. Let's go right here. Bam. Man, that was an old commercial. That might that might just age me. If you haven't figured that out already. And what was here? Oh, the candy. Ooh, I'm getting good at this. 30 episodes into the series. Okay. And again, I want to save this box. Please don't throw it away, my dude. I need it. All right. All right. We're good. Right? So far, so good. You coming to me? No? Okay. Big tease. No, this guy's still struggling here. I might have to fire him and rehire him because I, what, bro, what's, what's good? You need $6 and 10 cents of change. Gotcha. My dude is still struggling here. I wonder what it is. Huh? I, I might have to fire him. I wonder if he, I'm going to do it anyways. Cause I need to organize the store and he, um, he kind of, like I said, he he likes to restock stuff when I'm working on it, which is it. It's it's not the play, but um, yeah, I'll work on that. And then the only thing is, I can't tender this next. I want I want the shelves, and then we're obviously in need of. Wait, did I anything else? No, I didn't. We're obviously in need of some of these items, right? We said bread. All that three of you. I said. Flower, and then I, I need to grab at least one more of each of the new stuff. So I'll grab one of you, one of you, one of you, and one of you for now. And I'll tender out and tender that out in the morning and organize this. And hopefully he doesn't come back and he's still like stuck here. I don't know what it is about this area or this fridge that he's getting stuck. Uh, but anyways, let's go ahead and hit that young enter to see how we did. Three products not found. That was a product that I cannot bring up. Eleven twenty-eight in profit. Supply cost was eight fifty-two. I think we did pretty well, if I do say so myself. All right, and then we have the cheese, the Parmesan cheese. I'm gonna start saying cheese cream now, backwards, um, just because of this game. In my real life, people are gonna be like, "What is wrong with you?" And it'll be a really long story to try to explain. But I think we're good. I think we're good we've expanded we've organized uh we have 1600 so i'm pretty confident in ordering some of the re stuff that i need new stuff that i need i do want to thank you guys for watching this episode we'll stop here for today uh i'll bring another episode tomorrow and uh we'll keep going and see how much more we can improve upon uh make the store bigger add more products we're doing really good i'm happy where we're at if you guys have any suggestions comments on how to better this store experience please let me know Thank you for your time. Please take care of yourselves. I'll see you in the next episode. And don't forget, make good decisions. Talk to you soon.